Hi everyone, Giuliano here. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use language interpretation in Microsoft Teams. With this cool feature, language interpreters can translate in real time what a speaker says in a meeting. For example, you can have the main speaker which talk in English and then you can have a second speaker that translate in real time in Spanish. Pretty cool, right? So I'll walk you through every step to enable this feature and how to use it. Let's get started. Here I am in Microsoft Teams calendar. Before to turn on language interpretation, we have to create a meeting. I'm going to just name this new meeting. I name it this meeting language interpretation and then I'm going to invite someone else. There we go. These are the people that I'm going to invite to this meeting. Now I can click on send and the meeting is created. To turn on language interpretation, you have two options. You can open this meeting and then change the meeting options, opening the a tab in the browser. So for example, opening language interpretation meeting, I have here the ability to set the meeting option going in the three dots and then meeting options. Here just below I have this toggle button available, enable language interpretation. I can turn on this and now I can configure the interpreters. Who will be the interpreters for this meeting? I'm going to select Nestor Wilkie. The main speaker will deliver this session in English and this interpreter Nestor Wilkie will translate the main speaker in Italian. Also tap, I can click on save and all done. Now I show you that you can do the same joining the meeting. Now that I joined this meeting as the organizer, you can change the meeting options directly from here. This opens the panel on the right and here you can configure the language interpretation if you want. It's up to you the method that you want to follow. Now let's see from a end user and from an attendee perspective how it looks like this user experience. Changing perspective, I am now a normal attendee as Giuliano will join this meeting. The first thing that you can notice in this meeting is this pop-up that shows up. An interpreter can translate the meeting to another language. If you click on the button, you can select the language. If you don't click immediately, you can go on the more and then there is language interpretation option. Opening this pop-up, the attendee can select the language that he prefer, he or she prefers to listen. So in this case, we have the main speaker that will deliver the session in English, and then we have the interpreter, Nestor Wilkie, that will translate in real time this meeting in Italian. If I select now Italian and then I confirm, I will heard the voice of Wilkie louder than the main speaker. So I will hear the main speaker speaking and then louder I will hear Nestor Wilkie speaking in Italian because this is the language that I set and I selected in the language interpretation as my favorite language. Now I want to show you another thing going on people. We can see that we have all participants to this meeting and then we have a special rule for Nestor Wilkie, interpreter. So this is how it works, the language translation. And now we can start this meeting. Diego can start to speak in English and then Nestor can translate in real time and I will hear his voice louder. Welcome to the session. Benvenuti alla sessione. Quick clarification, if you have multiple interpreters, let's say that we have another interpreter for Spanish, but I selected the Italian interpreter, I will hear only him and not the Spanish interpreter. All right, we have seen how to use language interpretation in Microsoft Teams. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please consider to subscribe, like, comment. I hope to see you next time. Thank you for watching.